Welcome to the National Center for Computational Sciences at Oak Ridge National Laboratory, home to the Oak Ridge Leadership Computing Facility, or OLCF, and the supercomputer Titan. The Oak Ridge Leadership Computing Facility, OLCF, was established at Oak Ridge National Laboratory in 2004 with the mission of accelerating scientific discovery and engineering progress by providing outstanding computing and data management resources to high priority research and development projects. The OLCF is made available by the Department of Energy's Office of Science. DOE's Office of Science is the largest supporter for fundamental scientific research for energy. It's also the largest sponsor for research in the basic physical sciences. High performance computing is one of DOE's major initiatives. High performance computing has become an essential element of theory and experiment in many scientific disciplines. Often complex problems can't be solved in the lab because they are on scales that are too large, like modeling global climate, or too small, like modeling energy transport in materials atom by atom. Perhaps an experiment would be too dangerous or expensive, so researchers look to computer modeling for insight. The more computational power they have, the more realistic the simulations will be. As science demands more, supercomputers must get bigger and faster, and that is where the OLCF comes in. As a DOE leadership computing facility, the OLCF offers the high-performance computing and data resources that are 10 to 100 times more powerful than facilities typically available elsewhere for open scientific research. The OLCS flagship supercomputer, Titan, gives the world's most sophisticated computational researchers an opportunity to tackle problems that would be difficult on other systems. The OLCF welcomes investigators from universities, government agencies, and industry who are prepared to perform breakthrough research that run the gamut of scientific inquiry. These research projects are reviewed and selected based on competitive merit. Because it is a unique resource, the OLCF focuses on the most ambitious research projects, projects that require and can make effective use of one of the world's largest supercomputers. Now, let's take a look at the computer room which houses DOE's Titan, as well as many other NCCS systems. The computer room that houses Titan is approximately 20,000 square feet. Titan takes up about a quarter of that. If you add up all the space of all the computing capability we have here at Oak Ridge National Laboratory, we have about 60,000 square feet, or about one and a half acres of computer space. And that's another area of leadership for us, environmental responsibility. The building that you're standing in was one of the first in the country to be LEED certified, which means it was recognized for conserving energy and reducing harmful emissions by the Leadership in Energy and Environmental Design Program. In fact, NCCS is one of the most energy efficient computing centers in the world, as Titan is able to run its computations within the same electrical footprint as its predecessor Jaguar, but at up to tenfold the performance. The difference in Titan is that it uses a combination of central processing units, called CPUs, and graphical processing units, called GPUs. GPUs are lightning-fast accelerators that were designed by the computer graphic industry to model the world around us. This makes them perfect for the types of modeling and simulation that we do on Titan today. The combination of the CPUs and the GPUs make Titan one of the world's most powerful computers, capable of performing 27 quadrillion calculations per second. Surrounding the computer room are the offices that house the NCCS staff members, such as the system administrators that take care of these complex compute and data resources, or the user support team that help our NCCS users make effective use of these sophisticated resources. Or the computational scientists in fields such as biology and chemistry that partner with NCCS users on their research projects. Let's return now to the computer room to learn more about the other systems located within this facility. The NCCS currently hosts computers for the Department of Energy, 
the National Science Foundation, and the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, known as NOAA. While each of these agencies uses their computers in different ways, their primary goal is the same, to provide world-class scientific findings. The NOAA supercomputer, also known as Gaia, is used by both ORNL and NOAA researchers to further advance climate modeling and to study our planet's complex climate from a variety of angles. The Gaia supercomputer is capable of 1.4 quadrillion calculations per second, making it a 1.4 petaflop supercomputer. As we saw earlier, the OLCF is home to its flagship supercomputer called Titan. Titan delivers high-performance computing for the nation and the world and helps solve some of the most challenging problems of our time. The OLCF is hard at work delivering its next supercomputer called Summit. Summit will be available to our users in 2018 and will deliver more than five times the computational power than today's supercomputer Titan. We are proud to have led the way into the petascale age. We are even more excited to be pushing toward the next major milestone in computing, a supercomputer capable of doing a million trillion calculations per second, also known as an exaflop. Thanks for your interest in the Oak Ridge Leadership Computing Facility. We hope we've given you a better understanding of the important role that high-performance computing plays in scientific discovery, research, and development, and what it takes to develop and deploy the kind of innovative computing capabilities that help us to address the challenges on the frontiers of science. If you are interested in hearing about how researchers have used these supercomputers for scientific breakthroughs, please check out the additional videos available on this display.